most fulfilling part of being a, a professor, I think, here at the Kennedy School where I teach is the teaching, obviously, uh, interacting with students. I view them as peers, I respect them, and I want to have a, I want to have fun with them as we work through some really difficult uh, questions. There's no right or wrong answer. Well, there is, but the point is, I could be convinced of anything. I was born in uh, Oshkosh, Wisconsin, to uh, parents of uh, Egyptian origin. I spent my formative years uh, in the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. After the uh, Gulf War, my dad sent my older brother and I here to the States for boarding school, and then I just continued college. I haven't left. Uh, how many people come from authoritarian lands? Everybody else here is born under the bright sun of freedom? Just one person? Two? Three? Oh yeah, Chavez, man. Okay. I'm teaching wow. students about democracy, what it is, why we might want it, how you get it and how you keep it. You know, those who possess wealth and means clearly have channels to influence power. And I'm teaching this as we're seeing people in Egypt enacting this real life drama, trying to do precisely those things. I think there is something about transformative moments that overrides the logic of collective action. It just makes the what I'm teaching much more relevant for the students and much more, frankly, exciting for me to teach. You are all clearly well versed in the arguments that Hosni Mubarak and his men have been making to, keep, to stay in power. Um, Teaching, I think, is the way in which I do good because even if the ideas that I teach the students are completely wrong, uh, at least I'm teaching them how to think critically, I'm teaching them how to write better. Just, I want to see your ideas. If I see a minute extra was spent on something that's not about the idea, I'm gonna be very upset. I can't get upset, but you know what I'm saying. I'm okay. hopefully Any endowing questions? them with tools that they can use later on when they go on to do real good in the world. Yeah.